Hello, I'm Ray Strawn. I'm a Grenadian and Filipino actor and director in Winnipeg. I was born and raised in the north end of Winnipeg, involved in a lot of sports. Uh, wrestling was probably my first intro into theater, if I think about it. Theater was not a part of my life until I went to university. I want to work in sports management, and as you can tell, I'm a horrible public speaker. Uh, that stage fright has not left me, uh, but I decided, you know, I'm going to take theater and try to get rid of that stage fright. And I got into a show because I needed hours to bump my grade up, and I just fell in love with the process at the Black Hole Theater. And because uh, of Chris Johnson just fostering that love of theater and wanting to be around a company and collaborating, uh, that's how I truly fell in love with theater. Dependency on others and family and the need for collaboration and the need for energy from other people really encourages my growth as an artist uh, and it really keeps me centered. Family is a big thing both in the Caribbean and Filipino culture and I believe that because I have those roots it's allowed me to really open up in the rehearsal hall and depend and trust on others and hopefully I foster that kind of energy as well. And professionally I was able to work with a well-established artistic director in the city and that really opened doors for me. It really demystified all these great actors that you see on stage and these great performances and it's like, oh, these are just regular people with flaws like you and me. And it gave me the confidence just to move forward in the professional world by demystifying it. Because you know, as a student, you come out and you're like, well, these people are crazy. They do this for a living. There's no way I can go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. And then when she's seen them in the rehearsal hall, it's like, yeah, like me, like you. Like when, I, when I first saw you, I'm like, yo, this person, I saw an amazing show. But then I just meet you as a person. It's all good. I hope people take chances with the young talent we have. In Winnipeg, we tend to, unless you're a star right away, you don't really get the opportunity to grow and be amongst other artists. So I hope that happens in the city. I hope more young artists get opportunities to grow, to be in the room. We just get the chances. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. I've seen things not work with amazing artists. We just need to give them an environment, foster that environment for growth and confidence uh, and diversity and inclusion and equality. Uh, and we can't that, do that without the next generation and giving them a voice.